make sure, ladies and gentlemen, remember, all right, here's my decimal point, right? So the first thing I think is the easiest is, you know, and a lot of times I like just to move this around um, so that I can easily count it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. We want to go between the 6 and the 4 because that's going to be 6.47, which will be between 1 and 10. So I'll write that out. 6.47 times 10. But how many times do I need to multiply it by 10 to be able to get back to my original number? Well, how, many, how, many, how far did we move this? So if here's my new decimal point, I want to be able to move it how many spaces to the left? So it would be, again, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. But remember, since we're moving to the left, it's going to be negative. negative. OK? So be very careful with what is going to be positive and what is going to be negative.